morning, good afternoon, good evening, family. Welcome to the mental house with me, your host, Khadija. You know what, y'all? I am really bothered by the, the uh, amount and just the frequency of school shootings. I mean, this when, when, when a society mistreats their fucking elders and their children, then you know that is a society that is hell-bound. I have a long time come to the conclusion that America is just becoming a cesspool of madness. And the people that are, it seems like there's a large majority of people that don't care. When I was coming up, and I went to school in the 60s and the 70s, um, we had fire drills. And we had the notion that Russia was going to somehow send a bomb to America so all the families, everybody had fallout shelters. Or what you were going to do if the Russians attacked. That was as far as it went. I cannot imagine being a child going to freaking school every day and don't know if I'm going to be shot? What kind of society? This ain't no society. This is madness. We have become so barbaric in our thought process, in our behavior. We like we are human pigs. All of us. If you can't stop, if we can't stop ourselves from killing our babies and grow up babies that want to kill other people, as a society, we have failed the children. We have failed them. My heart goes out to all the families that, um, you know, had a loved one that was injured or hurt in the shooting on yesterday in California. My heart goes out to you. Um, it again, nowhere in a civilized society, a civilized, and that be that's the contingent word, civilized society. So we might as well forget all this faking that we're doing, like we're such an upstanding uh, country. No sane and rational country, group, people would even put up with this. It's madness. So, and, and I, when I came across this article, it said, how many shootings have there been in America since in 2019? So far, the number is about 70 incidents estimated nationwide and more than 400 since 2010. More than three quarters of them were during the school hours, and uh, K through 12 school, according to the K through 12 school shooting database. In those incidents, over 400 have been wounded, and over 200 have been killed. This is merit. On average, shootings at schools have been increasing since 2010, with the biggest jump occurring between 2017 and 2018. Hmm. Donald Trump, where incidents more than doubled. And y'all can't even see the signs of the time. Y'all are not putting this together, or either you refuse to, or you're so corrupt and evil that you don't care about the babies here at all, just yours. But I contend that whatever trap you setting for other people is going to be done to you and yours. Because the people that are in power, if they allow this to go on, and they have since 2010, 
they've allowed it to escalate every year. And it don't seem like nobody want to do anything about it no time soon but make a bunch of damn excuses. I'm sad for these children. Every day I wake up, I go, what about the babies? What about the babies? You know, when I go to the dollar store and when I have extra money and I buy a tip, you know, maybe five dollars or seven dollars worth of gloves or hats and I'm giving it to these kids when I see them outside because it's cold here. And we're in a society where you can live in the Midwest and it can get below zero and you can see kids outside with no hat, no coats, no nothing. It's everywhere. It's not relegated to no certain area, no certain people. We are failing our babies. We are interfering with the development of babies. And God can't be pleased with this. I don't care what you believe in. Can't be pleased with the way we are treating these babies. Look, I'm going to go. I'm going to go. And I'll see y'all in the next video.